Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up, you guys? So I want to talk to you guys a little bit about the Laramie Project um, by Moises Kaufman and the members of the Tectonic Theater Project. So um, pretty much what the Laramie Project is, it's a devised um, piece about a real story. So um, let's talk a little bit about it. So it was a story that happened, I mean, it was a few years back in Laramie, Wyoming. Um, <clears throat> It was, it was about the, this um, this teenage kid named Matthew Shepard. Um, he, he identified it as homosexual, and um, he was he was murdered. He was murdered by by two victims that that were charged for it. And so, pretty much, what this piece was, it's like this play is like um, from interviews of the people in Laramie, Wyoming, people who knew him. You know, friends, you know, because Laramie, it, that's a small town, so, like, every, everybody kind of knows everybody or, you know, everybody hears the same things, so. I'm um, sorry, I keep looking at the wrong camera. <clears throat> but, yeah, everybody knows the same thing, so. Um, the, the Moises Kaufman and the Tech the Tectonic Theater Project, they went around, they did, like, over 200 interviews, and from those 200 interviews, they, like, condensed it down and made this about its two hour play. Um, yeah, it's, you know, it's so like really monologue heavy because it's, it's from interviews. So people telling their stories on Matthew Shepard, you know, you, know, you have stories from his, his father. Um, there's even, you know, um, pieces from, from the victims, like um, from the, when the victims got interrogated. Um, you know, was his, Aaron McKinney was um a victim that that was um that was convicted, and um, there was a statement of him being interrogated, and so that whole like little piece from him from his interrogation to admitting it, um it, it's it's all in here, so it's it's a really deep and powerful play. Um, I I did it as a play about um a year or two ago in college, and I played um you know Aaron McKinney, so just playing just getting it to my mind that mindset of just playing a killer you know being you don't want to play him too evil but you want to play him like you want to have some you want to play him like entertaining but hateful but like something in him that that's like likable a little bit you know because it's too obvious to to play to play <laughs> to play a character that everybody hates you know there has to be something like a small part of it that's like oh maybe this guy isn't so bad you know but th that's kind of how you know I, I played it so <clears throat> yeah I, I had a lot of fun playing it um but yeah you, you can use it for um if you if you want a monologue to, to audition for something um or if you're if your school's looking to do a play like it's a very powerful piece and it's been played by different schools and it's kind of hard yes it is kind of hard to get the rights for it just because like it, it is a real story like this really happened a kid was really murdered you know in laramie wyoming so you know the the family is very sensitive about how you know their son images you know like portrayed and you know all, all that so but yeah it was a fun play to do um usually when it, since it's like so many characters, usually what they have you do is um, double, triple a cast. So like you'll be playing like three or four characters. I was like Aaron McKinney. I was DJ Shadow. I was like uh, the priest. Um, I think and I think that was just about it. So yeah, you'll you'll, you'll double cast, double, triple, quadruple cast. Um, it's really it's it's really cool play. Um, it's very very impactful. So I will. I had like, a lot of pleasure doing it. Um, I mean, what else can I r really say about it? Um, you know, there's pieces from like the protests of, of you know, people protesting for for gays, people protesting against gays. You know, there's there's both sides of it. So you know, there's there's all kind of different angles that they got in this play. So you know, it's a really salute to Moises Kaufman and the members of the Tectonic Theater Project. So. They made a really, really powerful piece, and like I said, it's the Laramie Project, you know, it's from Laramie, Wyoming, so if you guys have any questions or want to know more about it, 
uh, more information, more specifics, I mean, you either look it up or comment down below. I, I have no problems answering questions. You know, I just want to give you guys an overview about it. I don't want to get too specific when I do these play reviews because, you know, I don't, the, 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 <laughs> the, uh, the magic comes from, like, reading the play and doing the play and, you know, and discovering those little secrets about it. So, I mean, that that's a lot for the, uh, the Laramie Project. Um, there's there's so much um, from the a directing side. There's so much you can do with it. You know you can you can make it super dramatic, or you can you know have parts to to liven it up because there are characters that can be you know a, a comic relief. You know, so you can you can play around with things like that. So they wrote it to where you know you can have a little bit of freedom. It doesn't have to be a super dramatic set piece, even though that, that's what it is. You can you can get more out of it. You know that's just where. Uh, that's just where I, I I come from, you know, in my directive mindset. But yeah, thank you guys so much. Please, you know, subscribe to this channel. Um, this is my second channel. My main channel is just Devon Gorham. Um, that's where I do my short films and comedy sketches. This is where I just you know do my reviews. So, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys.